Good morning guys, happy Sunday. It is November 11th and today I'm picking up my boyfriend from the airport. I'm so excited because we haven't seen each other since like Labor Day weekend. I think it's been two months. I'm pretty sure that's the longest we've been without seeing each other. So that's kind of crazy, but he's coming for my semi-formal, which is on Tuesday. And then on Monday, we're going to go to Mickey's Very Merry Christmas Party. And today I don't really have like any big plans but I think it's just gonna be more of a chill day. We might go to the outlets, we might see a movie. So my car says it's 82 degrees. I honestly feel like it's 100 degrees outside right now. It is disgusting. Ryan is coming from like 32 degree weather from Georgia where we're both from. So this is definitely gonna be a big change for him. I really hope he packed like clothes for the warm weather because it's just, it's hot and it's not going down at all, which makes me so mad because I just want to feel a little bit of fall. That's all I'm asking. Just like 75 degrees and I won't ask for more, you know, but I'm going to get on my way to the airport. It's about um, a 28 minute drive and it says I'm going to be there at 2.04. So let's get on the road. What is this? The chicken stops here. <laughs> so how do you feel about the weather? Mm, when I got <clears throat> up this morning, it was 33 degrees outside. And now it's 84 here. <laughs> totally took my jacket off and threw it in the back there. It smells. <laughs> it does not. It does. I got the nervous sweats in the airplane. Why, did you think you were gonna die? <laughs> but we're going to get my eyebrows done. Best time of the year. <laughs> Yep, <laughs> honestly. I should have been my own. I have this little trimmer at my house. I can trim some eyebrows. Oh my god, he literally trimmed off half of his eyebrow. I yeah, know, I was trying to make him like thinner. And Wait, I like... show. But it was really bad right there. It was as thick as this, but... So I need to warn her, remind so me. So disappointed. What? I need to warn her. Oh, yeah. What? Hey, Mary. <laughs> I didn't put it in park. There's no chicken in that first yeah, it's bite. All chicken, Babe, there's no <laughs> chicken in that first bite. After eyebrows, we're going to go to our Airbnb. Um, and it's close to UCF. It was really cheap. Hopefully, we don't have a bad experience like me and Laura did in Tampa. That vlog will be linked down below. We literally had to leave our Airbnb. It was so disgusting. But I mean, it was cheap. So, like, mm, kind of my fault. It just sucks because, like, I feel like the Airbnb hosts always seem so nice. So, like, you always expect the best but like, I guess a nice person can live in a really gross house too, so. I'm honestly really confused about my color of my skin. My, my face looks really orange like in the camera, not the camera, not the camera, but like in person compared to my neck, but it's like as dark as my arms, you know? You wear a lot of turtlenecks. <laughs> do, you like, do you like notice that it's orange or no, a little? I mean, you're that color. Oh, so it's not bad. I just don't want to go too light because I feel like that will make me look really ghostly. Like, remember that one time that I had that really, really like light foundation? You, were you like, do it every New Year's. What? You do it every New Year's. What do you mean? She leaves like powder on her face throughout. <laughs> like, I'm gonna try something new. Like, I want to look like a bad bitch. And she wears like <laughs> some weird shit. Like, what are you wearing? Why are you make up like that? Anyways. Some eyelashes falling off and shit. <laughs> <laughs> I've gotten better at it. This is the first stage of entering the gates of hell. Getting your eyebrows on? They lay you down in a chair and they <laughs> say shit to you in other languages and they start ripping your eyebrows out. <laughs> Hi. Hi. So cute. Hey. So we are at Waterford Lakes. We were gonna see a movie at like 4.20, but Ryan took so long in the shower. Right now we are gonna take a video for like a sponsored Instagram post because I'm getting sponsored by Madden Girl. Like, oh my God, that's so cool. It's basically Steve Madden brand, but it's just like not Steve Madden. I don't even really know how to explain it. Anyways, I got these really, really freaking cool shoes. And so we're just gonna take a video of them for my Instagram. So I wanted all these palm trees to be in it, but like these cars are all, you know, here. So I don't really know how we're gonna do this, but hopefully it works out. Broken, but it's 
So we are done with my Steve Madden post. He did a really good job stabilizing the camera because I didn't yeah. use. Uh, <laughs> I don't really use a stabilizer when it's like vertical video, obviously, because they haven't made one for vertical videos for cameras yet. They've made one for cam like Sweet. iPhones, but not cameras, and they need to get on that because I would buy it in a heartbeat. VIP. VIP. So like I said, my foundation's a little bit orange, so we're gonna go to Ulta and see if we can get me another shade. I think I'm gonna get a drugstore foundation, okay, Ryan? It's not gonna be that expensive. Hopefully I can find a coupon somewhere in my email. I saw this Gucci um, perfume like in the front because it looks so like cute and millennial pink, and I have to smell it. I'm just very intrigued by the packaging. It's all about packaging, ladies. Oh, I'm totally not. Mm. It's like gardenia. I don't really like What's that one? Some gardenia. Over there. Gardenia. I tried that on your skin, whatever. I rub your hands together. I mean, like, it's like very summery, like, you know. Bloom. You know, it's like spring. It's like every plant. Yeah, very planty. Drugstore foundation. It is the L'Oreal Invaluable Pro Glow, and I'm getting it in the color 209. So this is 210. I think that's what I'm wearing on my face right now. That is why it's so orange. But this is 209, and then this is like the one before it, which is too light. Like I wish there was had something in the middle, but hopefully this one will work on my skin. But yeah, this is my favorite foundation. I mean, even though it's like super glowy, like I always mat it down with some powder, so it's not like crazy glowy, but I don't know. It's just really good. I love the formula and I highly recommend it. And I think it's ideal. So it's a win-win. I'm really excited about my new foundation and I also got a dose of colors lipstick and I have cork, but I got like the shade lighter. It's called Knock on Wood and it's what I'm wearing right now. We're going to Best Buy now. Look at the new iPad Pro. I hope it's there. You think it's actually gonna be there? Should be. Wow, so everyone else be here. All right, guys, we are here checking out the iPhone XR. <laughs> We're tech gurus. Hello. Hello. Is that with the small one like this? No. It's too small. Yeah, the whole thing is screen the size of my phone. It's so small. <laughs> the new iPad. It's so cool. I don't really understand what's even different, but like the new, like, um, what's it like called? Square. Structure of it. Yeah, it's square. Like, put a camera on it. It's like thin and aluminum. Yeah, it's really thin. It is. I like it. <laughs> yeah, That's funny. Yeah. Time for dinner. California Pizza Kitchen. We're gonna get margarita flatbread. I mean, no, sorry. Margarita pizza or mushroom pizza. I'm not sure we had. No, margarita. Are you sure? Thin crust? What does it not get? What does it keep in? I don't know. And mac and cheese. And that pot of egg rolls. Oh my. Right? That's wrong. I want your pieces with my pizza. So we are about to go in the Regal Waterford Lakes and we're gonna see Bohemian Rhapsody. We've been seeing like so many commercials ever since summer, right? Mm hmm. And it looks really good, so he's finally here. The Bohemian Rhapsody song like actually scares me. Every time it comes on, I'm like, heebie-jeebie. It's the most record, recognizable song like ever. I know, but it just like, it gives me the heebie-jeebies. It has every like, pitch and tone I think they said or something like that. Okay, what is the uh, other songs that he sings? We Will Rock You. Oh. Another One Bites the Dust, Fat Bottom Girls, um, Bicycle. You lost me. I'm excited because I haven't watched a movie in forever, it feels like. And then she's like looking at her pockets. Cool. Got my cozy jacket, I'm ready for the movie. <laughs> We just got out of the movie Bohemian Rhapsody and I personally thought it was really good like I don't really know much about Queen because 
my parents never really played like all that music <laughs> when I was younger, just yeah. cause like, I don't know, they didn't. A lot. It was just like his whole life. It was he's really pretty, interesting. He's Indian yeah, he, he yeah, I don't I still don't really understand. I think they said like Persian or something, but I'm not really sure. Anyways, it was really good. The thing that I like most appreciated about the movie was like the film aspect because like obviously I'm into like videography. Literally like I was shook at all the shot changes and like yeah, the I don't beginning know. Was so cool. Yeah, the beginning was so cool, like I don't even know, it went from like the sinkhole to like the, some bell type thing. It was just no, so was cool, satellite. like, satellite, yeah, whatever. <laughs> and, um, I don't know, I feel like a lot of like, just the shots, even at the end of the movie, there were so many like, really cool light flares, and like, I don't know, I appreciate that stuff, so, I loved that. Overall, it was a very, very, very long movie, and I was getting very antsy. I feel like it was like, dragged on a lot, you know? So I had like, a lot of music scenes added in, that, like... Yeah, a lot of little like, scenes. Kind of cut, cut short. Well, I was thinking how like, most of the way through the movie, like, it was like so fast. It was like, wait, what? It was just like, oh, he's a nobody working in an airport, and the next thing you know, they're like on a world tour within like yeah. four minutes. No, yeah, I thought the first then, part was like, so yeah, fast. And then the last part's so long. Yeah, I know. I totally agree. So yeah, that was kind of weird, but overall, really good movie. I'm kind of even surprised I like wanted to see that. So we are going to end the vlog here. Tomorrow we are going to go to Mickey's Merry Very Christmas party at Disney World. So definitely be sure to keep an eye out for that vlog. And I will see you guys in my next one. Bye! <laughs>